Hi, this is Mrs. Wong. We are looking at question 10 of chapter 5, worksheet 2. Okay, that's part of your homework. So we need to construct a quadrilateral x, y, z, t in which the information are uh, given. Okay, so all the lengths are given. Uh, we are even given one of the diagonal, which is t, y. This is a diagonal. Okay, I know it's a diagonal because t, y is here. Okay, so the other lengths, x, y, y, z, z, t, and t, x. Okay, uh, the points go from one point to the other point, so I know it's a length of the side. Okay, but t, y goes from t to y, so I know it's a diagonal length. Okay, so uh, I don't know how this quadrilateral will turn out. Okay, so I'm just going to uh, do a quick sketch. Okay, so uh, I'm going to start with ty then. So let's have xy, 3.5. Uh, ty is this direction. So, okay, this is 4cm. Then yz is 3. 0.5 as well. Uh, I don't know how uh, it will be like, so I'm just going to draw out. Okay, 2 cm, 3.5 cm, Tx is 3 cm. Okay, so um, this is just a rough guide. Okay, so with this sketch, I'm going to start by drawing xy, which is 3.5. So I will draw out a length of 3.5. I went a bit over. Okay, so XY. Is three point five. Now I have no information uh, about any of the angles, so what I can do now is I have to actually use my compass. Okay, so this is similar to question three of this worksheet, where I have to find the third and fourth points of the quadrilaterals using my compass. Okay, uh, to draw arcs of the lengths that are given. So I'm going to start by drawing for xt, okay, or tx, which is 3cm. So I'm going to measure out. Okay, 3cm. And I put my metal tip at x. I'm going to draw out the arc. Then for TY, since I know it's 4 cm, I'm going to use my ruler and my compass. 4 cm. Then put the metal tip at Y and then draw the arc. Okay, now these two arcs intersect to give me T. So I know that my point T is here. So I'll label point T. And I can actually draw Tx. Which is 3cm. And Ty. Which is 4cm. Okay. Now since Ty is a diagonal, uh, I will just represent it by drawing dotted lines okay so now that I have the third point you I can use T and Y to actually give me point Z okay so it's like another triangle altogether with T Y is 4 and then I get the third point on the triangle by using my compass so Y Z is 2.5 uh, 3.5 cm 
so I'll label 3.5 I'll draw the arc and then TZ is 2 cm so I'll label let me measure and find 2 cm okay so I'll put the metal tip at T to draw the arc okay and where the two arcs intersect that is my point Z where I have TZ is 2 2 cm and I have YZ is 3.5 okay so I label so there you go I have my quadrilateral X, Y, Z, T okay so I'm treating this quadrilateral as uh, kind of two different triangles where I plot two points then to find the third point, because I only have the lengths, I need to use my compass to help me find the point of intersection so that both criteria are met. Then after I'm done with this triangle, I will go on to the fourth point to find my Z. Okay, so this is for question number 10.